Suchir Balaji, a bright mind in the world of artificial intelligence, began his journey at the University of California, Berkeley. He graduated with a degree in computer science, a field that would shape his future. Balaji's talent was evident early on. He secured internships at prominent tech companies, including Scale AI. His skills and potential led him to OpenAI, a leading artificial intelligence research laboratory. Joining OpenAI in 2019, Balaji quickly became a valuable asset. He worked on training GPT-4, a powerful language model. His contributions extended to improving the performance of ChatGPT, a chatbot that gained global recognition. Balaji dedicated himself to his work, driven by a passion for the potential of AI. He believed in its power to revolutionize various industries and aspects of human life. However, behind the scenes, a growing unease began to cloud his perspective. Balaji's time at OpenAI was marked by success. He witnessed firsthand the incredible capabilities of AI. He collaborated with brilliant minds, pushing the boundaries of what was possible. Yet, amidst these achievements, a sense of moral conflict began to weigh on him. The very technology he was helping to build raised ethical questions that he could no longer ignore. This internal struggle would ultimately lead him down a path of whistleblowing, challenging the practices of the company he once admired. As Balaji delved deeper into the world of AI development, he became increasingly troubled by OpenAI's data practices. His concerns centered around the use of copyrighted material in training AI models. Specifically, he questioned the company's claim of fair use, arguing that it lacked ethical and legal grounding. Balaji believed that using copyrighted material without proper authorization or compensation was a violation of intellectual property rights. This ethical dilemma created a deep conflict for Balaji. He was torn between his loyalty to OpenAI and his growing belief that the company was engaging in unethical practices. He saw the potential for AI to be a force for good, but he feared that OpenAI's methods would ultimately harm creators and stifle innovation. In August 2024, after much deliberation, Balaji decided to leave OpenAI. His departure was driven by his unwavering commitment to his ethical principles. He could no longer be complicit in practices he believed to be wrong. His departure sent shockwaves through the AI community, raising questions about the ethical implications of AI development. Balaji's decision was a testament to his integrity and his belief that technological advancement should not come at the cost of ethical considerations. Balaji's departure from OpenAI was just the beginning of his fight for ethical AI development. He refused to remain silent about what he had witnessed. In October 2024, he took to X, formerly Twitter, to publicly criticize OpenAI's data practices. His tweets sent ripples through the tech world, sparking a much-needed conversation about the responsible use of data in AI training. Determined to shed light on the issue, Balaji went a step further he authored a blog post that provided a detailed account of his concerns. The post, cited by major publications like the Chicago Tribune, delved into the legal and ethical complexities surrounding AI training data. Balaji argued that OpenAI's use of copyrighted material went far beyond the bounds of fair use, setting a dangerous precedent for the industry. In his blog post, Balaji meticulously outlined the potential consequences of OpenAI's actions, he argued that the company's practices could stifle innovation by discouraging creators from sharing their work. He also highlighted the potential legal ramifications, predicting a wave of lawsuits that could cripple the nascent AI industry. His blog post served as a wake-up call, urging the tech community to confront the ethical challenges posed by AI development. Balaji's public criticism of open AI did not go unnoticed. His actions made him a target for those who disagreed with his stance. On November 25, 2024, a copyright lawsuit was filed against OpenAI, and Balaji's name was listed among the defendants. The lawsuit alleged that OpenAI had infringed on the copyrights of numerous creators by using their work to train its AI models. Tragically, on November 26, 2024, just one day after the lawsuit was filed, Balaji was found dead in his San Francisco apartment. The cause of death was determined to be suicide, with no foul play suspected. The news of his death sent shockwaves through the tech community and beyond, casting a dark shadow over the debate about AI ethics. The extent of Balaji's involvement in the lawsuit remains unclear, 
however his death served as a stark reminder of the high stakes involved in challenging powerful tech companies. It also highlighted the immense pressure and scrutiny that whistleblowers often face. Balaji's tragic end left many questioning whether more could have been done to protect him and support his efforts to expose unethical practices in the AI industry.